What's going on everyone, this is Jemmy Mash and uh, we're back with another answering question series, so I'm going to answer some of your questions yet again guys, as always, to leave a question just put it in the comment section below and I'll answer them in the next episode, so let's get to answering questions. So the first question comes from Snowboss, he says, would I rather have a blowjob from Charmander or a handjob from Geodude? Now they're both pretty fucked up because Charmander has fire in his belly and he burn my dick off and a hand job he'd probably crush it. I'll guess I'll have to go for the burn so I'll go for Charmander. Gears Tag says, do you think Formal Friday or Dom's Funeral are good event ideas? Dom's Funeral is only players Dom and they make a map of the death scene. Formal Friday is all infectant Lambent humans only in Horde. They both sound like freaking amazing ideas, dude. I'm liking the idea of Lambent humans in Horde. I think a guy had a similar idea for like Halloween, have all the Lambents in Horde, because that would be messed up, and have the uh, have it like on gridlock with the uh, darkness. That would look pretty sick. Assassin Raymond says, If you had a chance to make TV and be the star of it, would you do it? And if you do, what kind of show would it be and why? Well, of course, if I had the opportunity to be on TV, I would probably, uh, I'll go for it, it would be very nervous and uh, <laughs> it's not, it's thing with YouTube and being on TV is, is completely different. Uh, being on TV there's probably going to be a live crowd and you're going to be uh, live in front of millions of people. When it comes to YouTube I'm just in my bedroom recording this now, nobody's watching currently so there's no nerves, there's no pressure. Um, if, if what kind of show it would be? Well, it'd probably be a game show or something. I enjoy watching game shows, they're my, always my favourite type of shows, and I think I'll be a decent host for those. Get Pingalai says, Are you going to do a Final Fantasy Let's Play? That would be awesome. Um, when it comes to the old Final Fantasies, I don't plan on doing those for a while. I'm probably going to stick with what I'm doing now and uh, stick with new games. Uh, but if I grow as a channel in the future, there's potential. The new Final Fantasy, Final Fantasy Versus 13, uh, well I say it's new, it's not even out yet, but when it comes out and it'll be brand new, I'm definitely going to do a let's play on that because it looks amazing, like seriously, probably going to be one of the greatest RPGs, uh, in my opinion, just from some of the gameplay and the cutscenes I've seen on, and the trailers, if you haven't seen it yet, definitely check it out, it looks sick. Extinct Gaming says, if you could know how long you had to live, would you? That's a tough one, um, no. Because if I knew I was going to die very soon, I'd probably get paranoid about it, get a bit crazy. I'd probably uh, try and avoid my death and things would be weird. Um, <laughs> that's a messed up question really. I, I think it's best to not know when you're going to die. Because if you know you're going to die tomorrow, I guess you could just go out and get laid and just fuck everything. But you'd be scared. You'd be scared as fuck because <laughs> as a human being I'm scared of death, I'm scared of the unknown. And it's just best not knowing. It really is just best having no idea when you're going to die. Kansas says, where do you see yourself in 10 years? Wife, kids, job, still playing games. Um, okay, this is a big one. 10 years time, I, I sure hope I have a wife by then. Uh, honestly, um, I've never really been good with talking with females. Um, I actually uh, usually nerve up a bit. Um, Kids, well, if I get a wife, then I'll... Well, the thing is with having a family and a wife and kids, it's something I'd be best off or I'd rather do after ha I have a secure good income because having a kid and a family takes a lot of money and I don't want to work in, like, shit jobs. Like, I've been working in Domino's for a year now and I don't think it's a good job and I don't want to work in low-paid, uh, labour-type fast food or whatever jobs to support a family. I would want a good job and that means education or something to uh, support that. So in 10 years, um, I'm going through education again next year no matter what. I'm, I've, I'm 21 next year and I really need to go back through the education and get my uh, life in order. So um, hopefully in 10 years I'll go through the education, meet, meet, meet the woman of my dreams I guess you could say, uh, whilst at college or uni. And uh, hopefully, yes, that'll happen. Job, well, that's going to relate to what I do in college, I'm hoping. I'm going to do uh, businesses, I'm going to do business and science. Uh, in college, I don't know what route to take yet in uni. Uh, I might start my own business. I have a slight idea. It's going to be, um, actually I'll save this for a, <laughs> a different commentary. Um, it'll, I'll link it in with something else I was going to talk about. And if, if I decide to start the business, I might do that. If not, I might do something in, in, uh, in science, like um, maybe work in a pharmacy or uh, make drugs and stuff. I don't know, if that's, just, if, that's if I go for the chemistry aspect. Um, it's too early yet for me. Shadows Carnage, Vegeta or Goku? It's gonna have to be Vegeta because he is badass. 
Jake the Snake Willard. What do you use to record? If it's a laptop, can you tell me about it? Like all the essentials. I use a HD PVR, which is a HD capturing software. It's about £150, which is uh, maybe about a couple hundred dollars. Um, I use my PC. It's a desktop, not a laptop. Laptops usually have less gigahertz and are not as fast as uh, desktops because they're obviously they're mobile and they're smaller. Um, I would say you need at least about maybe two to four gig of RAM, uh, maybe a terabyte of memory, and um, at least a dual core processor, preferably a quad core. They're the best. Okay, Fat Man Scoop 97. What are your thoughts on the Sword Off patch? I haven't even noticed a difference to be honest with you. I played earlier today. I got Sword Off a turn. I haven't noticed anything. King360256, what's the best clip you have in Gears 1, 2, and 3? My best ever clip out of all three games is the the quad I got in the beta with the blind fire. It's up on my channel. It's called the best sniper clip yet, question mark. Um, it's a pretty sexy clip. What was your first video game? And what was your first rated, M-rated video game? I don't know about M-rated, but my first video game I think was something like Space Invaders or something. I was about four or five years old, and I just remember playing something like Space Invaders. II X Boogie II, do you watch One Piece? Yes, I do. I'm actually currently reading the manga online. It's a great show. Football skater, favorite South Park character? That'd have to be Cartman. I love that guy. Ted G1, Pepsi or Coke? I'd have to go for Coke. I think it's uh, a better tasting drink, obviously. Uh, in my opinion, Saddis Knight, do you think you're better than like butter? <laughs> Uh, no, I wouldn't say I'm better than him. He's been in the competitive scene and stuff, and I think he overall he probably is a bit better than me. Maya Frozen, do you plan on making a montage soon? Yes, I'm actually currently uh, getting clips as uh, as I do this commentary. Um, I have I think a bit over ten clips. I I don't play this game nowhere near as much as I was expecting to. I play the game every day, but not for a very long time, maybe for an hour or so. Um, I've been doing other things, but I will have a montage in the works, and it should be out quite soon, so uh, <laughs> keep on the lookout for that. Stevie X1, uh, this is the final question by the way, I've written these all down in notepad. He says, what do you think of Battlefield 3, and am I going to get it? Um, I've seen the beta, um, they're going to fix all the bugs in the actual game release, which is nice. Uh, it looks pretty good. It looks like a good game. The thing is with Battlefield is I, it's a confusing game for me because um, I haven't played it. Uh, well, I played Battlefield 2 beta. I wasn't very good. Um, I don't know about getting it yet. I'm going to wait for the first initial response from the from people when it actually comes out. And if it's a good response and a lot of my friends get it, I might get it. And, um, you know, I'm just going to wait and see. So that's all the questions for this time, the gameplay is coming to a close, um, just leave a question in the comment section and I will answer it in the next one, so thank you for watching guys, hope you enjoyed and I'll see you all in the next video.